We'll be taking a look at DOLV currently traded at 0396. Remember, this is about 1.30 p.m. Eastern on May 3rd. So remember, this is going to be during the trading period. We went over this one on the first just a few days ago. Selling needs to slow here. That's what I said then. Here, in my opinion, resistance at 0.4850603. Support at 0. 352 must hold and you guys are getting that bounce off that 30 day simple moving average we see coming in here right now i'll be watching for a possible bounce coming here with this one in a possible rally back up uh again just my personal opinion because it is starting to hold that 30 day simple moving average fairly well here so keep an eye on that uh, again i said before the selling needs to slow down here it possibly looks like it could be trying to do that uh, maybe the seller's out, whatever the case might be. We're going to be watching for a possible bounce off that 30-day simple moving average. Again, that 30-day simple moving average is going to be a must-hold, currently at 0378. A break of 0543 would be a bullish move for sure. So uh, that's going to be the 10-day simple moving average. I'm not going to worry about that one as much as that would be for the 0515. A break of that 0115 uh, up there, 0515, I apologize. 0515, a break of that. Could send this one up much higher. I wouldn't be too concerned with the 10 day, but it will be a little bit of a resistance level. And I will put that in there. But remember that 0515. Give you guys a little bit of insight on that, on my opinion, with DOLV currently right now at 0 0.0403. We're going to put the resistance lines in, following up on that, around that 04. Seven five, and when Joe's ready, he can let us know if there's any. Yeah, updates. so no, no, no updates. I mean, these guys, we haven't heard much from them since uh, Dolat Ventures on April sixth. Dolat Ventures acquired by a China-based battery manufacturer. So, I mean, that's the latest update we've had from the company. That was on April sixth, so we haven't heard from them since. So, I mean, it hasn't been that long, but I'm sure we'll hear something soon enough. Because I mean, they just got acquired by you know a China-based battery manufacturer. And that is that. So uh, if you want to continue doing more due diligence on the company, feel free to go over that DOLV board on Investors Hangout. From there, you'll see the company profile, the time and sales, the recent news, the filings, the financials, the buy rating. It's all right there at your fingertips. And uh, if you have an opinion on this company, feel free to share it with the tens of thousands of like-minded investors that we have used on the site daily by posting right over there on that Dolot Ventures Incorporated board. All right, with all that stuff that Joe was just talking about, you'll see all the options right here, completely free. And one of my favorites, I know I talk about it quite a bit, is the time and sales. You see that right here with the time, price, and volume for each trade. So if you don't have a level two or whatever, and you'd like to come home after a long day of work and take a look at all the trades for the stock, look at that right here at your fingertips. Go through the day and kind of play it out in your head. Uh, again, if you don't have the luxury of sitting there and watching a level two all day, 0443, resistance at 0475, 0515, and 0543, support at 0378, must hold. Watch for a bounce from here. If buying picks up, a break of that 0515, 0543 would be a bullish move. Could be possibly happening right here in front of us. So we're going to watch this. Very closely moving forward, DOLV, if you follow the stock, make sure you hit that like and subscribe button. We'd appreciate it. And most importantly, get out there and share this video uh, with all other investors and different social networks, stock message boards, and stock forms. The more you share it, the more we cover it. That's how it works. If you'd like to participate, you can do so by heading over to investorshangout.com forward slash live.